We learned today that China, hackers linked to China have accessed a very sensitive database containing security clearance information submitted by intelligence and military personnel and, and other security clearance holders. Anyone who's in the intelligence business or needs a security clearance in the United States. So a former top counterintelligence official in the U.S. government told us that it's incredibly damaging because for one thing, it gives the Chinese a roadmap to everyone who has a security clearance in the United States, their names, their information. So it's a, it's a gold mine in terms of spy recruitment and also just knowing who's who in the government. Secondly, it hurts their ability, the ability of these people to go on and do other intelligence jobs in the government because now their information is exposed. We believe it, it happened through a spear phishing attack, which is a spoof email that causes somebody to download spyware, malware onto a network. But um, what the officials are saying is this was a very sophisticated attack. That's why they think it was a nation state. So the Office of Personnel Management has had a history of data breaches. I mean, they've testified that they are under constant cyber attack and that they've lost data before. They generally haven't been forthcoming about exactly the extent of the damage and what has been lost.